Good morning, guys. It's Laurie from Passionate Penny Pincher. It is day 14 of Croctober, where every day for the entire month of October, we are making dinner in our crock pots or our instant pots, um, actually mostly in our crock pots. You can get your totally free Croctober cookbook at the link below. You can also order the Croctober book cookbook and listen to this, guys. If you have been waiting to order Croctober, it just dropped big time in price. Like it had been $14.95. Amazon decides the price on it completely. I don't have any control over it. It just dropped to 11 bucks. So if you have been waiting to order this one, I would love for you to get it. I think you're going to love it. Um, you can also print the free one as well. Good morning, Stacy. Hi, Shannon. Guys, good morning. Y'all, can you tell me this morning, tell me where you're at. I am racing crazy late to Bible study this morning, and then I'm picking up 40 pounds of chicken breast. So tell me what is on your big to-do list today. What is the one thing you have got to get done today or your day is going to be behind. I have a ton of chicken, so I have to tell y'all I'm kind of cheating on today's recipe and I am turning it into a freezer meal because, as y'all can see, my crock pots are ready. I'm going to show you. I have all my Zaycon. I'm going to show you what's in my bag that is all my Zaycon stuff. So we're going to talk Zaycon today. We're also going to get this freezer meal done. I hope you're making the chicken enchiladas because they are fabulous. So today's recipe is slow cooker chicken enchiladas, but like I said, because I've got 40 pounds of chicken coming today, um, I did not want to have to deal with all of it. There's only so much I had to give myself a little grace here so here's my grace this morning what I'm doing is I'm prepping the slow cooker chicken for the enchiladas I'll go ahead and put it in a freezer bag and then I will um, tell y'all how to go through the, and do this yourselves you can make your own homemade taco seasoning mix it is in the back of the cookbook um, the recipe for how I do that however today like I said we're given lots of grace because I have a crazy day and there's no way I can do it all. So I have to do what I can do and let it go. So to make the slow cooker chicken enchiladas, if you had a slow cooker here, what you do is you would pop in four to five boneless skinless chicken breasts. Oh, and hit that share this button and we will give away a $25 Amazon gift card. Then you're gonna add in a packet of taco seasoning mix. Um, and like I said, you can get the recipe for the homemade version at home if you'd like, but um, I'm making life easy today. Then you're going to add in a teaspoon of garlic powder. A teaspoon of lime juice. I don't have lime juice, so I'm using lemon juice. Nothing's going to be just fine. And then you're going to add in a dice, a can of diced green chilies. Okay, so if you were had your slow cooker, you would just turn your crock pot on. You'd set it to low. You'd let the chicken cook all day long in the crock pot, and you would be good to go. Easy, easy. Then at the end of the day, you shred up your beef or your chicken. Um, I'm going to go ahead and get all the air out of here. You shred up your chicken. You would mix together so a can of cream of chicken soup and a cup of sour cream. You would put that on the bottom of the bottom of your baking dish because you're actually going to have to bake these enchiladas, but they are so yummy, guys. If you make one recipe in here, this is like one of my all-time favorites. Um, so you would put those in the bottom, you'd layer half of your sour cream and um, cream of chicken soup one, then you would put the um, tortillas, you would put the meat into tortillas along with the sour cream and ch cream of chicken soup. My dog is out there having a heart attack, bless him that he's not in here, so hang on, he's going to sit here and bark until I let him in. Come on in, buddy. Okay. Sorry about that, guys. I knew he was going to sit there, and now he's going to look through the trash. He's going to hope to get to the trash, so we're going to put that away. Goodness gracious. I don't know. Can y'all see this crazy dog who sits at my feet? Okay, so what I'm going to do, because I'm making this as a freezer meal, is I'm just going to pop this in here. But what you would do is you'd go ahead and make your enchiladas. You would pour over. I like to use the green enchilada sauce. You'd pour that over, add some sliced olives, make your enchiladas, and then you bake it. This is what it looks like when it's done. I feel really bad that I cannot... This one is so good. What I may do is I may make this one. When I do make it, I'll do it on live so you can see it. Um, look at this one right there. Slow cooker chicken enchiladas. They are delicious. Good morning, Lucinda. Guys, let me know what you are up to today because this is kind of a crazy day as far as everything goes. And I'm going to tell you why in just a second. How many of you guys, what do you pay per pound of chicken breast, for boneless, skinless chicken breast in your hometown, how much do you pay typically? And I'm gonna tell you what I'm doing today and why I'm doing a freezer meal. So I'm just gonna double bag these and I've got dinner for another night ready to go. Okay, let's talk chicken. How much do you pay 
per pound of boneless, skinless chicken breast. I'm gonna show you what we're gonna do. I am so excited because I've never done this before. But today I ordered 40 pounds of boneless, skinless chicken breast, 40 pounds. And y'all are not gonna believe how little I paid. Oh, Dawn says she pays $2.89. Adeline says $1.99 a pound. Hi, Sandy, good morning. Okay, guys, guess what I paid? And you can download this. This will make, will make your life so much easier. I paid $1.26 per pound. Now, I am getting 40 pounds of boneless, skinless chicken breast, but I have it comes in a huge thing on a truck today. My dog is trying to get into the trash can over here. Summit, come here. This is why I don't let him stay in, because he loves to get in the trash. Anyways, okay, so it's $1.26 a pound. Crazy price from Zaycon Chicken. This deal will not come again, so if you've missed it already, you won't get it until 2018. But you, if you have it, or even if you don't have it, you can print your ultimate Zaycon Chicken cookbook. So last night I was freaking out thinking, what am I gonna do? I've got all this chicken breast. And so I pulled together my bag of goodies to get ready for my chicken. Are y'all ready? Y'all see my cute, my Dickies barbecue advertising for them. Okay, so I remembered, I thought, what am I gonna do with all this chicken? I'm freaking out. Then I remembered my amazing friends, Shree and Stacy and Cheryl, who help on the Passionate Penny Pincher team. They made us a list of how to do this. So I pulled out my list, and I love this list, y'all. You can get this list. Um, we'll put a link in there for you to get the list. Um, yeah, this is exciting. So basically, they tell you exactly how to do everything. So I went through, and I grabbed my stuff. So what they told me I needed was some freezer bags. So I have freezer bags, because I gotta deal with 40 pounds of chicken at two o'clock today. So I got the small bags, and I got the big bags, okay? So these are the things you're gonna need. Is anybody, give me a heart or a like if you are getting, um, who else ordered the chicken? Is anybody else getting chicken today? So I've got my bags, got my freezer bags. Then she said I needed a large onion, so I got my onion ready. And then I need a jar of minced garlic, which is in the fridge, so I'm not gonna pull that out yet because it'll be a while. Then I need some seasoning salt, so I've got my seasoning salt, some olive oil, and then I need kosher salt and pepper. So I have all of my goodies ready. Do y'all look over there in the corner? Look over here. Y'all see the corner over there? Right there, I've got my crock pots ready. So what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna deal with 40 pounds of chicken today. How exciting, I've never had so much chicken to deal with. I have no idea what I'm gonna do. It's gonna be a little bit crazy. Um, but I will do a video, I'm not sure if I'll do it live this afternoon or if I will just replay it later, but then you can see kind of how this is gonna work and how if it's worth it. Somebody asked about the quality of the chicken. The quality of the chicken is, um, from what I've heard, amazing. I have not tried it yet. So we'll see how it goes, um, but I'm super excited about trying it. I've heard amazing things about their bacon. I have not gotten their bacon yet, but I think it's gonna be really, um, I'm hoping it'll be good, we'll see. Um, but if you are interested in learning more about Zaycon, I will pop a link into there. You can get your Zaycon chicken cookbook for anybody who has, it's totally free. We just created it. I'm so glad that we have it because basically what it does it is it's gonna tell you what to do. So what I love is it even says, like this is how awesome they are. It says purchase your items bagged needed for bagging and pre-cooking the chicken. So I've got all my items. Pick up chicken from the delivery location. Make sure your kitchen is clean, which I'm gonna do real quickly before I leave here. Arrive home, unload your chicken. The chicken will come, it comes in four 10 pound bags. Um, and then you're gonna prepare the chicken. So we're gonna make cooked chicken, marinate chicken, and we're gonna bag the raw chicken. So 40 pounds. Lots of chicken. It's going to be kind of a crazy day, but I think it's going to be fun. Um, you asked Rondell if it's available in Canada. I, I, Canada, I do not believe um, that it is available in Canada. I don't think so. Somebody says it is, um, but the nice thing is somebody said it's um, not available in Massachusetts. It's available, check and see, because they can't available in a lot more cities than I realized, so they may have it in your hometown, and it will save you so much money. Starla, you said you made the tortellini soup adding spinach instead of broccoli, and it was a major hit. Oh, I'm so glad y'all like that one, Starla. Okay, so I will just chit chat and answer some questions. I'm gonna sit here and clean up my kitchen, because like I said, I'm heading to Bible study. I'm late, as I, well, I'm not late yet. But if I clean up while we clean up the kitchen and we can chat, I'll answer your questions. Um, and I probably will. Somebody said take us with you when we get your chicken. I probably will take you guys with me. Um, I'll probably do a live video while I'm picking up my chicken so you can see how it goes. Um, I'm kind of excited because I'm going to pick up some for a friend. And they said that's pretty normal is that people will pick up chicken 
like for a friend because obviously it's kind of a pain to have to go somewhere else in town for me it's about 30 minutes that I have to drive um, so yeah we'll see how it goes Dawn you said your family loved the chicken taco, taco chili I am so glad they enjoyed that one that's fabulous these little freezer things are gonna come in handy today because these make holding up all the bags for all the chicken way easier so we're gonna have that um, oh, 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 and I want to tell you guys, there's an awesome deal on candy today at Amazon. So if you need candy, um, Halloween candy, great deal at Amazon. We will pop a link in there so that you can have that. Don't forget guys too, I've meant that, mentioned this at the beginning, but I know a bunch of you guys hopped on later. Crocktober cookbook is on Amazon. It just dropped in price to $11.16. That's the lowest price it's been. The, um, we do not typically end up sitting there um we don't t typically we don't have any control over the price so amazon controls the price of it so i'm kind of excited because it was 14.95 it's 11.15 so if you are interested in the crocktober cookbook snag it while it's cheap i would love for you to have one um you would grab oh elisa that's a great idea yeah tell me what else i should do here for the chicken somebody said that i should grab gloves and i saw susan that you said that I, you would pay to watch me as i dealt with the nasty chicken you know i'm going to be grossing out completely as i deal with chicken today but i'm going to do it it's worth it it's so worth it um a dollar 98 on sale is a great price that's awesome well, yeah let me know your prices i'm seriously sitting here i'm going to put my freezer bag while i answer any questions that y'all have and then i will come off um we're making it fast and furious today. You're gonna have to buy, good morning, you've got your coffee, study a bit, and kids are at school. What a great way to start your morning. Is the cookbook different than the printable one? It is not, um, no, it is not different. It's a little prettier. Um, I'll just show it to you. This is gonna be backwards, can y'all see? It does have a little forward. It also has the daily graces. Can y'all see that? Um, but I love those. So, oh, Susan, I'm so glad you ordered a book. A cooler in the car. Stacy. that's a great idea, especially if you have a long way to go. I think I'm okay. It's pretty cool out today, so I feel like I'm going to be okay. Um, I thought about popping a cooler in my car for um, because I'm bringing extra people's stuff home. You have not gotten the email from the cookbook. Oh, Shirley, please, 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 Shirley, do not be upset. Send me an email at contact at passionate pennypincher.com and we will send it out to you because I definitely want you to have that cookbook for sure. It will make your life so much easier. So please send me an email. We will get it fixed for you. You submitted your email. Yes, guys, if you're having any problems at all, if you're having any problems at all getting a hold of the free PDF version, please send me an email. Contact at passionatepennypincher.com um, and I will do that. Are you guys excited to see hopefully I don't know how the chicken's gonna go today we'll say it's gonna go great but anyways um, I oh Sherry I'm so glad you like the um, daily graces in the book oh that was a good idea somebody said take a thermal tote bag that's a fantastic idea y'all are smart at this the box and it comes in will keep it cold for hours joy so I should be fine awesome okay yes yeah, Jessica the cookbooks would make great gifts and don't forget I forgot to say this I still have garlic on the spoon um, if you use the code Oh, Nicole, you're going to have to remind me of the cold. I believe it's PPP Croc at checkout. You can also get $2 off the spoons. And what's cool is when you see, when you go on Amazon to buy the Croctober cookbook, the spoons are right there. So try PPP Croc. I believe that works. PPP to get $2 off of these spoons, but we'll write that. Anyways, um, thank you all so much. I'm going to scoot off so I can get to Bible study and get my chicken. I will be back. It'll be, I think, this afternoon around 3 or 4 when I get my chicken. It's going to be crazy, um, but I'll try and do a live from the, it is PPP Croc. Thank you. Um, Donna, you said like, you like my jean jacket. I have had this jean jacket for seven years. I bought it the first time that I did a coupon class seven years ago and it's my favorite thing so um thank you donna i like it too don i'm so don and tina you got your cookbook i'm so glad you got it y'all have the very best day i will see you later today probably i'm not sure if i'm going to do it live i'll probably do the pickup live um but then i won't do the I won't do the um, boxing. We'll see. I go, I'll figure it out. You guys have the best night uh, or best day, and I will see you tomorrow morning. Talk to you soon. Bye-bye.